Hi, my name is David Burke, and I'm one of the artists in the Dreams and Their Edges exhibition. We're here in my studio in Oakland, California, and I'm going to walk you through the space and share some of the things that I've been working on recently. One of the underlying themes in my work is this relationship between the natural world and human-made industrial forces. And so in the paintings, I let these elements play out and interact with one another. And sometimes they coexist harmoniously. And in other times, they find themselves in conflict with one another. All of the work is made with acrylic ink on acrylic panels. I've been looking at a lot of aerial and drone photography recently. The thing that I find so interesting about these kinds of images is that they create a disconnect and a distancing between the viewer and the subject matter. And I think this mirrors the fractured relationship that we currently have with the environment and the natural world. I think a lot about mining and our compulsion to extract resources from the planet and the negative consequences of these actions. I also think a lot about the resilience of the natural world and how despite all the pressure that we're placing on it, it still finds a way to grow and sometimes even thrive. I think it's important to reflect on the power and the beauty of nature and how even resources like clean water or clean air that we often take for granted are things that we're really going to have to fight to protect in the years to come. Ultimately, I feel that artists at their best are like lightning rods. We take in all the experiences in our lives and everything that we see going on around the world, from the joy to the pain, to the triumphs and the failures. And these elements filter through us and manifest themselves in the work. And so what I'm chasing in these paintings is this messy dance of contradictory elements that I hope closely resemble this moment in time. I'd like to thank Erica Hess for your wonderful podcast, John Seed for curating this exhibition, and thank you for joining me on this studio tour.